Do you know the right of Allah upon his worshippers, and how you thought about how to fulfill your obligation towards Allah? The right of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala upon his subjects is to worship him alone and not associate anything with him. Tawheed, meaning Islamic monotheism, is divided into three categories. Tawheed of al rububiyya meaning lordship. Tawheed of al uluhiyya worship. And Tawheed of Asma'i wa Sifat, names and attributes. Tawheed of al rububiyya means singling out Allah by his actions. We affirm certainly that he is the one and only Rabb, singled out through creation, provision, and in disposing of affairs. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the meaning of the ayah, Say, who provides for you from the sky and from the earth, or who owns hearing and sight, and who brings out the living from the dead, and who brings out the dead from the living, and who disposes the affairs? They will say, Allah. Say, will you not then be afraid of Allah's punishment? We also acknowledge that he is alone in ownership and in giving life and death. Ultimately, benefit and harm is from him who alone answers the supplication of the needy. He, subhanahu wa ta'ala, showers his countless blessings upon all his subjects from creation, while granting particular blessings to the believers through the gift of guidance. He is the Rabb, creator, and all-capable, al-Qadir, over everything. Nothing exists and nothing exits the realm of his lordship and everything in the heavens and the earth is a servant to him within his grasp. The polytheists ag- themselves acknowledge Tawheed of Rububiyya, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, and indeed if you ask them who has created the heavens and the earth, they will surely say, the Almighty, the All-Knower created them. Al-Aziz al alim Despite this, that it was not accepted until they acknowledged Tawheed of Uluhiyya and Tawheed of Asma'i wa Sifat. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the meaning of the ayah, O mankind, worship your Rabb who created you and those who were before you so you may become Al-Muttaqoon, meaning the pious.